everyone, it's Vanessa and welcome back to my channel. Today, as the title says, I'll be doing the process of getting this pink, very pink hair. So if you're interested, then just keep on watching. The reason why I decided to make this video is because when I posted the picture of my pink hair, a lot of people commented and asked me like how I got the color and how is it possible because I had pretty dark hair and so many questions um, like where I done it, like where I had it done and blah blah blah. <laughs> I don't know what that was but like just a lot of questions. So I decided to sit down and make a video about it. I wanted to have different color hair since I was younger but I was always afraid to because I had this group of people with, that I went to school with and I was afraid that they are going to judge me and they're going to be like, oh my god, you look horrible or whatever. So I was always afraid to do that. So I decided that when I'm done with high school, I'm going to do this. Bleach my hair, put pink on it and do whatever I want because after this day, like the end of school, I'm never going to see them again. Like. I mean, not never gonna see them again, but I'm not gonna have to go to school and see teachers and they're gonna be like, so. That's why I decided that after I'm done with the mature exams, which are like finals in Slovenia, I'm gonna go do my hair. So I was done on 19th of June and I got my hair done on 19th of June, like just two hours after my mature exam. So yeah, I went, um, now, my hair was done by this, like, one of my family friends that I, I had known since I was little and she said that, like, probably nobody's gonna, nobody else would do that to me because I have really dark hair and nobody would probably want to bleach my hair three times in a row. But since we know each other and she was like, fine, it's you, so we're gonna do this. <laughs> so we did it. Um, I had the appointment. I, we decided that I'm gonna come over at two and I went home at about seven or eight, I think. So I was there for about six hours. Yup. We bleached my hair three times. The first time we bleached it, it turned out yellow and I'll have like a clip playing right here. Um, the second time we bleached, so the first time I bleached my hair, it kind of like itched a bit. It wasn't painful, but it, it was freaking like my head was on fire. I wanted to like scratch the shit out of me but you know you can't do that so we rinsed the bleach off and then we put another bleach on like the second layer of bleach um and then it started burning but it was not like a bad burn she was like it does it burn bad i was like no not really so the second time was pretty fine like it was pretty much fine we again took the bleach off it was still orange yellowish but it was less orange um but this, the thing is that where we did that she had like a orange type of lighting so i when i went back my hair looks different than what it like what it looked in real life there was a lot of difference between first bleach and second bleach but on camera it doesn't really show that much so keep that in mind and then the third time you bleached my hair it burned a lot more than it did the first and second time it was pretty painful but I was like I can do this it wasn't that painful that time yet so we bleached it again and we took the color off and I don't know how it looked because after she like um, washed the bleach off of me she put toner in it so I, I I saw how it looked after toner if you know what I mean so after she put toner in my hair, my hair looked kind of blonde, yellow, grayish. And again, I don't think it shows that on the video, but it looked decent actually. Um, and when she put the put the like toner thing in my hair, it burned a lot, a lot more than bleach did. I, I was like, oh my freaking god, this hurts so bad. And then she rinsed it off and she was like, now we're gonna put pink on and I was like yes pink woo that's what I wanted and god damn it I did not know I did not prepare myself she was like this is gonna burn and I was like okay you said that two times before and it didn't really burn that much 
oh my god guys i can't even explain when she put that on me she was like oh i'm sorry because i was like i was in pain and she like said sorry like a hundred times i was like it's not really your fault you're doing this because i want you to do this and i was like you warned me we knew this was gonna happen like stop like you don't have to apologize to me um so it burned like ah, it was so bad like my eyes were completely red like i wasn't crying but i was about to my nose like my bones hurt my legs started hurting my muscles in my legs actually hurt so bad and i can't even explain it it's crazy i know but it happened it was oh my god it hurts and it hurts so we're like really freaking bad um so we had to wash it out like out and it didn't take like you could still see the orange yellowish blonde color like right here which kind of sucked but we were like fine you're gonna come back in two days and i did um i'm gonna like like you saw the video that i made but on the video it looked way better than it did in real life like if that's what it if my hair looked like it did in my previous video i would keep it that way it was fine so i went back and we colored no we bleached my hair again not the whole head but just like up like here and then we toned it again and then we put a lot of pink on it as you can see my hair is really really pink but i actually dig it i like it i didn't think that i was gonna like it uh i thought it was gonna be too pink and i was so scared but i really like the way it looks my my family actually likes it except my dad my dad doesn't really like it <laughs> my sister does my boyfriend does my friends do so it's fine um i think it looks really cool actually so yeah that's basically the process of me getting pink hair if you ever wanted to get them done but just keep in mind that if you have really really dark hair not every hairdresser or friend will actually want to do that to you because normally people don't go from dark to white in a day like i did i went from really dark to really light and now i have pink hair and i bleach my hair four times which normally hairdressers don't do because it's a long process and they just like you know stretch it and you can get like to this color in like a month or longer that actually happens and it's really expensive um in that case uh thankfully for me it wasn't um so yeah i'm really grateful that i know her because ever since i was a little child i always cried when i came home from from the hairdresser hairdresser any kind of hairdresser um I, I would cry so bad and when i met her i fell in love i will never go anywhere else and this is why i actually let her do this to my hair i would not go to just anybody keep that in mind also because i am obsessed with my hair i really like it so whenever something goes wrong and if they cut it wrong i cry a lot i know it's bad i'm really sensitive about my hair so you gotta know she's good i really love her so yeah thank you again if you're watching this thank you so much i love you and yeah that's basically if you have any other questions about my hair like anything else that you want to know there's like a whole comment section where you can comment and ask me things and i will answer them um if you enjoyed this video also give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you want to if not that's fine too so yeah Thank you guys for watching this video. I love you all. I appreciate you. I appreciate you. I do. Um, so yeah, thank you for watching. And I'll be doing like my hair care routine soon because you got to take care of this. <laughs> so yeah, bye. I put my eyelashes on so weird and they kind of burn. Like, not burn, but like, they, they're poking me somewhere. I don't know.